Hey, sweet friends, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian, and today I have a laundry motivation video for you guys. You guys seem to really love anytime I upload any type of laundry video. I don't know if it's because you guys always have a ton of laundry like I do, but I definitely always have a lot of laundry to do. So this is going to be a laundry routine type of video. I'm also throwing in some organization. I need to organize a few of my drawers. So I figured I would go ahead and throw that into today's video. So if you guys have some cleaning to do around your house or organizing, I would love for you to clean and organize along with me. Right now, I'm just pulling out some of my clothes from my drawers. I did get rid of a few things, not much, just because I feel like I've been doing this a lot. So I've been getting rid of a lot lately. And I want to go ahead and just refold all of this because I wasn't able to find a lot of things. Every time I would go into these drawers, everything was just stuffed in here. I could also barely open or close the drawers. So I thought it was time to go ahead and organize it all. My husband's side, I did refold some of his clothes. I just didn't get rid of anything just because I don't know what he wants to keep and get rid of. I always say that anytime I organize the closet or the drawers, I will reorganize his side. I just won't get rid of anything. And then I do the same thing for my pajama drawer. This is the drawer where I keep all of like my loungewear and also pajamas. I did get rid of a few things from that drawer and I probably kept way more than what I needed, but I feel like I have mostly summer and like spring pajamas. One thing I do want to do is go out and see if I can find any winter pajamas because I feel like a lot of my winter pajamas that I wear aren't really necessary pajamas they are more like leggings and stuff like that so maybe I can go out and buy some cute winter pajamas and then I can get rid of a lot of these leggings because a lot of these leggings are super old and faded I just keep them because in the winter I like to wear like long pants to bed because it's pretty cold but like I said I don't have any winter pajamas so that's definitely something i'm gonna go ahead and see if i can find any cute ones if you guys have any suggestions on where to buy some let me know i always have a problem with buying pajama pants because i'm so tall they're always high waters on me or i wash them one time and they become high waters so let me know in the comments where is a place to get some really good quality soft and cozy winter pajamas so high nightstand this is where i keep my socks and also like my bathing suit and bathing suit covers and 
doing this, like organizing it, made me realize I really don't have many just plain white or black socks. I have a lot of like fun, cute socks. And after watching this, I was like, I definitely need to go out and buy some just plain socks because sometimes I don't want to wear these festive cute socks. I just want a simple pair of black ones or a simple pair of white ones. And I only have a handful of those, but I am a sucker for cute socks, so I do enjoy wearing those as well. So I'm just going to go ahead and organize that. There were a few socks that were either really old or it was missing like the matching socks. So I did get rid of a few socks and then I just threw everything back into the drawer. Calling the moment that I was convinced we we'll stay up to morning and head out exploring Make up for months that we've missed On this day, I also did wash our bedding. So I'm just taking off our bed sheets and also our pillowcases and I'm gonna throw that into the wash as well. I would 
be an astronaut Get me high above the atmosphere with you I would fly across the sky Build a house from satellites I would dance without no gravity with you So won't you tell me is this something you'd be wishing for? Cause heaven is a step away, just open the door Fire up the rocket and away we go, me and you hey. originally waiting for our clean sheets and pillowcases to get out of the wash and then i realized that we bought a backup pair of bed sheets so that when one pair is in the washer we can just go ahead and throw on the backup pair so we don't have to wait for it to be done so like i said the other one was still in the wash and i went ahead and grabbed our extra pair and Put it on our bed i also did take off some pillowcases from our um decorative pillows just because one of them had a stain i think one of the kids on accident got their marker on it and i want to wash it and then the other one i don't know i think madison was eating like chocolate and she got it on the pillow so i usually don't take out these pillows from these cases just because i feel like when you wash them it kind of messes them up but i tried to spot clean it and the stains weren't coming out so i decided just to go ahead and remove that and throw that in the wash as well hoping that the stains would come out all right you guys we are at the end of this video so i just want to say thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed it and found some motivation from it if you have not already please consider subscribing i would love for you to be a part of my youtube family i hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day and weekend and i will see you guys next time bye